uh, day nine now. We are still in uh, Hoi An, uh, exploring the streets, the market of Hoi An. Uh, so it's around uh, 12 o'clock in the noon, 12, 12 30. So we'll be exploring nearby pagodas and then we'll be having a lunch at some new cafe. Pagodas. pagodas. So we found a pagoda here. We're uh, going inside now. We found a very nice ice cream shop and we took one ice cream which is, tastes like lemon and one like cookies. Very good ice cream. The name is uh, Bollywood. It's near the old Japanese bridge. If you just cross the Japanese bridge, you'll find the shop on the right hand side. Definitely spend a week in Hoi An. This place is so cool. Everything here is amazing for shopping, for food, the, the atmosphere, everything is so good here. So I bought this hat, cap and uh, one uh, t-shirt which has like a uh, full red color and the Vietnamese uh, flag star on the between. This place is seriously, there are so many things. We don't have so much of money to spend here. And this place is also famous for uh, uh, tailors, right? Yeah, uh, there are many shops you can just go. Uh, they will take your size and uh, give the give the clothes in a day. That's all in a day. So if you're coming to Hoi An, bring lots of money and lots of space in your bag because this place is again I'm telling you the shops there. Right? It's around uh, five o'clock in the evening now. I'm still in uh, markets of Hoi An. Exploring the market, doing some uh, little bit of shopping and trying local food. We, went, we found uh, Indian food as well, like this butta. <laughs> we are very quick to pick anything which looks a little bit like Indian. Only one. Oh, yeah, we. Andy, you both are very good. Selling, selling this uh, uh, what looks like a mango cake. So, we bought one, it's around uh, 10,000 dong, 28 rupees Indian currency, and it's pretty good. There are peanuts inside, and, uh, some sugar, and I don't know what. No, 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 pretty good. Uh, last night in Hoi An, uh, we came out for dinner to this uh, Vietnamese chop stick and they have freshly uh, brewed beer as well. So this is only for 5,000 dong in Indian currency. It's only only 14 rupees, 14 rupees for this mug of beer. So we ordered three mugs and uh, yeah, if you are uh, having this with me, if you order food, then 5,000 dong. Otherwise, 6,000 dong. That's 16 rupees only. So. 
will be uh, going away from uh, uh, Ho Hoyan now. Okay. We'll be going to Ninhua okay. and uh, we'll taking a train from here. First, we have to take a cab for Dana from here. That will uh, take around 40 to 50 minutes. So morning, uh, we'll reach uh, Ninhua and then we'll be going to some other places. And from there, we'll be going to some very uh, uh, secret place which most of the people don't know. Uh, mostly the international tourists or travelers, only the local people know. So we'll be showing that tomorrow. Cheers. So uh, we reached uh, Danang railway station. Uh, it took us around 40 minutes from Hoyan. Uh, so I'll show you how the railway station is in here. This is the entrance. The timing of the trains. This is our train, SE7. 10.30 when it will come, 10.40 when it will go. Okay, we don't know the platform and all. I don't know how to check. And this is the waiting room. Uh, uh, so can you see this uh, glass door behind? From there we have to uh, reach the platform but uh, th these doors are not open yet. Uh, they open just uh, before the trains arrive so that nobody else can go on platform before that. So most of the people you see here are in, st uh, in the waiting room just before the platform gate. This is the one of the interesting thing I found here and uh, uh, the frequency of uh, trains in Vietnam is uh, pretty less so there are only four trains which go from Da Nang to South to Ho Chi Minh so we are taking one of that and this is the last train of the day and after that uh, trains will be there for the next day so uh, it will be the first time I will be traveling in a train in Vietnam so let's hope it will be good. We are inside the train, so the train arrived on time. Uh, so I'll show you how the trains are. Trains are really good. This is our cabin. We have lower berth, middle berth, and the upper one. Pretty clean though. Nice blanket. And the pillow.